sowing seeds of heavenly wisdom. James chapter 3 verses 17 to 18 But the wisdom that comes from heaven is first of all pure, then peace-loving, considerate, submissive, full of mercy and good fruit, impartial and sincere, peacemakers who sow in peace, reap a harvest of righteousness. When James talks about heavenly wisdom, he is not just talking about being super smart. He is describing a way of living, a way of being that's pure, peaceful, considerate, and full of good stuff. First off, let's talk about purity. This means being honest and sticking to what is right, no matter what. It's like keeping your heart and your actions clean and free from anything shady. Then there is peace loving. This is all about being a peacemaker. Someone who tries to get along with everyone and doesn't go looking for trouble. Instead, they bring calmness and harmony wherever they go. Consideration is another important part of heavenly wisdom. It's about thinking about other people's feelings and needs, not just your own. It's like putting yourself in their shoes and treating them how you'd want to be treated. Submitting to God's will might sound fancy, but it's really just about trusting God and following His plan for your life. It's like saying, Okay, God, I trust you to lead the way. Mercy and good fruit go together. Mercy is all about showing kindness and forgiveness even when someone messes up. And good fruit, well, that's what happens when you spread kindness and mercy around. It grows and makes the world a better place. Being impartial means treating everyone fairly without picking favorites or judging based on appearances. And sincerity, that's just being real and honest, no faking it. Now here's the good part. When we live with this heavenly wisdom, it's like planting seeds of goodness everywhere we go. And guess what? Those seeds grow into a big, beautiful garden of righteousness. It's like spreading love and kindness and watching it come back to us in amazing ways. So let's aim to live with this heavenly wisdom every day. Let's keep our hearts pure, spread peace wherever we go, think about others, trust God's plan, show kindness and forgiveness, treat everyone fairly, and always keep it real. And when we do, we'll see the amazing harvest of goodness that comes from living with heavenly wisdom.